Hey friends, it's your girl Nick Alexandra and I'm back. Thank you for being a friend. a video of your friend Onika Alexandria so I feel like I feel like you are subscribed right but if you're not go ahead and subscribe okay yeah yeah go ahead and do that do that do that do that and if you're a returning subscriber hey best friend how you doing ow listen so if you've already seen the vlog which hopefully I'll have it up before you see this video then you already know I was on a hunt for the fruit market so these are the fruits that we picked up do i remember all of the names no <laughs> are we still gonna try them anyways sure is sure is sure is sure is so uh to start off we have cocoa so this is like what you would make chocolate with so i'm really excited to try that then we have passion fruit y'all already know i love passion fruit or maybe you don't know that's okay i love passion fruit and i usually have the yellow passion fruit so i'm excited to see about the purple we have yellow dragon fruit and i already know according to tiktok if i eat this whole thing i don't think shit <laughs> all right these last three i don't remember what they're called hold on i gotta look them up all right, so this is a Nasberry or Safadilla. I will admit, I did try this one already. I remember <laughs> there was also another gentleman that was there, and he tried it as well, and he was like, it tastes like a sweet potato mixed with something. I don't know what else he said, but it's so true, and I'm so excited to try this again. So this one is known as a Mammy Apple. Mammy Apple. I could be saying that wrong again. I'm trying to find this one. And I feel like I feel like people know what it is, but I just don't. <laughs> okay, hold on. All right, this is Mango Steam. There we go. I know I'm going to find it. All right, I'm just excited. What do I want to start with? What I want to start with? I think I'm going to start with this one. Oh, my God. Oh, these are ripe. Ooh. So now I've only had the pink of these before. I've never had the, the yellow. So I'm excited to try. It's like, I mean, they're not moving, but it's like little <laughs> white lines going through. They're not moving. So, you know, that's a good sign. Okay. Okay. Wait, why is my mouth watering? Okay. Okay, all right. Yeah. No, it was definitely sweeter. Mm, that's really good. It's definitely sweeter than like the red one or the pink one I've had. Wow. See, that's crazy because I could really eat this whole thing off. <laughs> Why? Why would you make me have to go bathroom? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my God, that was really good. I feel like I should have started with the passion fruit because that's the most common taste to me, but passion fruit meat. Oh, -hoo -hoo. this is juicy. Oh my God, this is so juicy. All right, so that's the inside. Ooh. Ah, it's so juicy. Oh my god, I miss this so much. Oh my god, I miss this. Oh my god, I miss this. Oh. Y'all, passion fruit. Passion fruit never does me wrong. 
passion fruit never does me wrong. Oh my god, it's like a mango. Like passion fruit never does me wrong. Ooh hoo hoo hoo. And ladies, <laughs> just like pineapple. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Tried, tested, and proven true by yours truly. I'm telling you. Just like pineapple. All right. Okay. Now, a lot of people may be tasting like pineapple, but not a lot of people gonna be tasting like passion fruit. Wow. Wow, give me back the scented, please. Taste-wise, I feel as though yellow passion fruit and red passion fruit or purple passion fruit has no difference in taste. I would say the only thing is is that the purple passion fruit is a little bit bigger than like a yellow passion fruit. But that was good. Oh my god. I want to try this one next too. Someone was telling me that this is um Mancy Port. There we go. That's the that's the fruit name that um my friend in St. Kitts told me that this is supposed to be like the equivalent to. Me and my mom is highly suspicious and we do not believe it, but we're going to see. Okay, right away, right away, I can tell he lied <laughs> because this does not have the, the scented seed like the Mancy Port. He must be lying. He know who he is. <laughs> All right. This is the one that was like sweet potato and it, you know what? Very reminiscent of sweet potato. I don't know if I could eat the skin. I feel like you could. Yeah, I feel like you could eat the skin. Uh, is it customary to eat the skin? I have no idea. So I'm going to peel it. I'm going to peel it. It's crazy because the skin has like the same like texture as a sweet potato when it's baked. Okay. It does taste like a sweet potato. Mm. It actually is really good it is really good see like even if you peel it like don't don't cut off the skin just peel the skin it it gives like the same texture as the sweet potato i don't know if you guys can see that can you guys see that like that part right there it looks very reminiscent of like sweet potato i mean is it good yes yeah it is ooh, 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 ooh. It's crazy how it tastes like sweet potato. <laughs> but it's good though. Wow, we're already down to the last three. Okay, so we're gonna try mango seed next. And I didn't ask how to open it. And I believe like there's like a big seed in the center. I think he will open it. Uh, maybe that there's maybe there's not a seed. I could have sworn I seen a seed. I don't know if this is good to eat. This side looks like that. See, it has like those brown spots on the edge. So is it good to eat? I don't know. We're going to try it and see still. All right. I highly doubt that, that you would eat the skin on this one. Okay. This is the part that was in the middle. Wait a minute. I wasn't expecting that to be that good. So like you like I literally just cut it in half and then um peeling back the outer and the inside. The inside also looks edible, but I highly doubt that it is. Oh my god, I have more of these too. I'm too excited. Oh my god. No, these taste really good. Okay, top piece, are you coming or no? I mean, you're gonna be, you're gonna get eight regardless, like, so you might as well just come. I didn't, I, I didn't mean it like that. I, I really, okay. Wow. Mm-hmm. 
There's a scene. But let's do it. Wow. <laughs> wow, Manga Scene gonna see me again and again and again. Wow, where else can I get that? I mean, like, in America. All right, this one is very soft. I'm like, wh why is it so soft? Okay. Oh, there's a seed in the middle of this one. Ooh. Is that? I don't know if you guys have seen this. Like, it was obvious. I don't think it's a spider web, but like a spider, like a spider web type of thing. Oh, is this good? I don't know if this one's good. It may be overly ripe. Uh, I don't know. Like, the outer corners look a little bit darker. I mean, I already skipped it out, so. <laughs> no, let me show you on this one. Oh, my camera. Oh. Oh, okay. Well, uh, so, like, oh, it doesn't look that bad on the camera, but. The outer rings look like a brownish, while the inner piece looks like a coral. I don't know if I'm gonna like this one. Yeah, yeah, I don't really care for this one. I think it was just overly ripe. So. I'm not going to give it like a hate, but what I am going to say is that's not my favorite. No, that that's an unfair face because it's not, it's not that it's bad. It literally just tastes overly ripe. Like I could tell that that was just extremely overripe. And the last one. <laughs> now, hold on. Give me one moment because this is just staring at me. <laughs> it's just, I don't know why it's just staring, but it's just staring. Wow. Cause I'm really about to go take a mean shot. It. Wow, that's crazy, but mm, all in the name of fruit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, all right, this last one, cacao. I'm trying to remember how did he cut it. I think we could just cut it in half. It reminds me of a banana. It reminds me of like a, a guinea and a banana. Guinea more so how you have to eat it, but banana in the taste. And I'm definitely saving the seeds because I want to try to make chocolate. This is a, I don't know if I want to eat all of this. This is a lot. The bigger the seeds, I the fresher they are, and the sweeter they are. Mm-hmm. Very reminiscent of you know, but it does taste good. I will say that. Mm-hmm. And that jaw is gonna work out. Okay. I don't know how much flesh you're supposed to be eating. Like, should this be, like, clear, clear? Not, obviously not clear, but, like, like all the way down? So I can see the seeds completely? Or, like, should I be, like, the, the mango professional and clear it all off? But the closer I get to the seed, the less sweet it is. Oh, my God. I would just think about, like, the hot cocoa that this will make. Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. So... <laughs> Friends, if you are ever in areas that have these sort of fruit, definitely try that. I will say from least to most would be this one. Again, it's unfair because it was, I think it was just like overly ripe. So I don't think I was able to like really give it a fair, like a fair taste test. You know what I mean? Uh, so that that's my least. My second least favorite was 
this one. Not that it don't taste good. Not that like there was anything wrong with it. It's just out of the array of these fruits. Okay. Yeah, th this is my second least. Okay. My third favorite. And the only reason why this one is third is because it's a, it's a workout. Mm. Your draw. Okay. Your draw finna get a workout. But I'm too excited to make chocolate with this. I'm too excited to make chocolate with this. Let me know if you want to see a video of me making chocolate with the with the seeds. The process. Okay. All right. Runner up. Runner up. Runner up is going to have to go to yellow dragon fruit. Listen. It's. Mm-hmm. <laughs> It's so good. It is so good. I wasn't expecting it to be this sweet. Because the pink just isn't... The pink just don't do what I want it to do. And the yellow is definitely giving me what I want it to give me. Actually, in second place, I'm going to have to give that to Mangosteen. Because that was just a pleasant surprise. Oh my God. So second place, Mangosteen. That means that my top favorite, once again, top overall, is passion fruit. There is just something about that, that, that tart, sweet, sourness. And here's the thing with passion fruit, okay? If you're eating the fr passion fruit while it's picked right off the vine and it's still plump, that isn't, that, that isn't the sweetness. You're not getting the sweetness of passion fruit if you just pick it right off the vine and cut it up and eat it. Y'all have to let it sit and get wrinkly. Oh, lot. Listen, let me tell you something, right? With passion fruit, the wrinklier, the better. Only with passion fruit, though. Only with passion fruit. But the wrinklier a passion fruit, the sweeter it tastes. I, I promise you this. I promise you. I promise you, promise you, promise you. So, yeah. Overall, top passion fruit. Listen. I want to try it again with some other fruits. Let me know what other fruits I should try this with because <laughs> my palate is severely happy right now. Okay, I I am I am I am literally like overjoyed of how good these fruits are. Oh, I'm so excited to make some cocoa with this. All right, friends. So that's the end of this video. Let me know if you have tried any of these fruits and if you have, which one was your favorite. Also, again, let me know what other fruits I should try. I'm, I'm, I'm really trying to, I'm really trying to expand the palate. You know what I'm saying? I'm really trying to, you know what I'm saying? Get more culture. <laughs> so if you made it this far, you watched a whole time video, go ahead and comment this secret emoji. So I know you're a real one. And if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe. Yep. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Go ahead. You know what I'm saying? My cute little picture down there. Go ahead and click on that red box down there that says subscribe. Go ahead and do that for me. Thank you very much. If you have enjoyed this video, go ahead and give me a big old thumbs up. Sorry, I know that you like these types of videos. Yes, friends. As always, with love and 266 kisses. Bye, friends. Oh, I wonder how I saw those. Let me how that did that seed drop. Show your love for a nigga.